Holy fuck, third time's a charm. Okay, hi guys, I am YouTube Rebel, and before I even start on the topic I want to get to, I'm not going to get up on your face. I made a bead, and I want you guys to see! No, fuck, okay, I'm going to have to put my keys back on. No, but I made this bead. And I painted it, it's made out of wood, it's not plastic, and... Then I was making some rings in my material science class, and it's made out of wax. This one's mine. And then, since I feel like I'm being a dick to my sister all the time, 24-7, I want to change, so I'm making her this ring. And speaking about change, warning, watch the very end before you make any rash decisions. If you were friends with me in the 8th grade. So, lately I've been thinking that I, I want to change, and I, I don't know how. I mean, I wish this could be like a, a live stream or something, but mm, I'm good. <laughs> but anyways, I... I see people I knew in the 8th grade here in my high school right now walking through the halls and I've, I want to be friends with, with these people but I don't know how to tell them that because I feel like I'm either A, gonna be put down say, I don't want to be friends with you you hurt me da -da -da, or punched in the face and I mean... I, I want to I want to change and I want to be friends, but I don't know how. I mean I, I really don't. What do I do? How do I make it better? Cause I mean I don't know what you're thinking if you know who I'm talking about. And obviously you're finding out what I'm thinking. And I just want to forget the past and be friends again. But you don't have to if you don't want to. Damn, my sister's crying because she's not in this video. I love my sister so much. Da -da -da. Anyways, yeah, I'm just saying. If, yeah, um, I don't know how to say this. Um, I'm sorry. I really am. And I know I said that so many times. And <sighs> anyways, different topic. I'm going to show you pictures of baby me. And mom, if you're watching this, you're in this these pictures, okay? And there's nothing bad or gross. Nothing sexual. That's what you're wondering. Okay. Pause this video. Go down in the comments below. Or think to yourself, what does baby say I look like? I mean, you see me now. Shaved head. I've given up on myself. I frigging pierced my ear for everything. I do the Okay. So, let me just lay out these pictures. Also, Mom, if you're also watching this, Grandma's going to be in this video. And I should grab a picture of Grandma. Because... Yeah, hold up. Ah! Hey, Grandma. You're joining me today. Yoink! Yep! Okay. That's going in grandma section. Okay, so everyone thinks that Stephanie, my stepmom, is my real mom. And I mean, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so this is this is little me. I was a fat, chubby little kid. And I'm shaking a lot, I'm sorry. Yep, I had my dad's curls. Curse those curls. Okay. Okay, so the rest, this is the last one with me by myself. The rest of them either has just my mom, me, and my mom, my grandma, or just my grandma. So there's another picture of little Saya. <laughs> I was... That was a weird little girl. So chubby. 
Was that, am I always this chubby? <laughs> Tell me if I'm chubby or something. Okay, these next ones are going to be of me and my mom. So you guys get to see my real mom today. If you ever knew my mom or seen my stepmom, now you know. There's little Saiyan, my mom. Yep, I'm naked. Oh, yeah. Warning, nudity. <laughs> don't, don't flag this video. <laughs> God. <laughs> Never mind, continue on. Yep, I'm feeding my mom something. It looks like she's eating my hand. Were you eating my hand? <laughs> oh, yep, yeah, look at that golden smile. Oh, yeah, so snazzy. This one's gonna be my grandma, my real grandma, and me. So. Yep, yeah, this is my dad's old big truck. I miss it, but no, we have a sell it. Um, the rest, there's two pictures of just my mom, and then there's gonna be one of just my grandma. So. Hey mom, I have pictures of you now. I'm not weird. I'm not stalking you. <laughs> this is my mom. Um, this is when, because I have two sides to my house. So this is when we lived on the other side. And I remember this couch and everything. And then the last one's of my grandma. And I miss her so much. We had such a close bond. I mean... I remember the day my mom gave this to me is when it was on her funeral, but my grandma didn't want a funeral. She wanted to have happiness, and she didn't want to thank anybody to be sad about her because she was that way, because everyone wants to cherish her. So she wanted everyone to cherish her memories. This is my grandma. Yes, I am Native American, if you were all wondering. Um, and if you guys, I'm going to show you my stepmom and my best friend, Kalia, because I have pictures of us, of them. Kalia, you're coming off my wall today. Um, should I get pins? Uh, no, not today. That's for another. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I know I keep shaking the bed. So, this is my stepmom. And everyone thinks she's my real mom. When really, this woman is my mom. That's my sister. Um, they're both really pretty. I mean, they're beautiful women. Just... They're, they're different, though. They're different in, in the same all together. This one is my best friend, Kalia. She changed a lot. Trust me, she doesn't have the same hair. But I keep this on my wall as well. She has that cute little blonde strip in her hair. I think this is when we were nine. And how we first met, um, her dad came to my mom's restaurant at the time. And... We kind of hung out in the park <laughs> behind the restaurant, and we played lots of games, and I brought her to Christ, and it was a great day. I met my best friend, and I never thought I could possibly meet someone as amazing as her. Holly, no offense. <laughs> but I know I'm kind of an asshole to you, Clea, if you're watching this by any chance. And that's only because I love you. I mean, really, you're just a sister to me. And I want you to know that I care about you, even though I don't call all the time. Or maybe I'm not. you're not always on my mind. But I always have you with me. And I want you to know that. Um, this is another picture of us when we were in Waitsburg with my friend, or Pam. And... That's Clea, and that's me when I had red hair. If anybody of you remember my red hair, <laughs> I loved it so much. It was 
some of the best hair I've had besides this. Um, this one is Baby Me, My Dad, and My Mom. And these were some of the best memories of my life is because when my family was a real family. And everyone was together. And they didn't split. But everything's happy now. I have two families to love. Um. Let's see. What else? What other pictures can I show? Here. I'm just going to take you on a tour of pictures. Because I don't want to keep taking them off my wall. Did I just stop it? I'm still playing. Okay, that scared me. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so I have... Can you... You can barely see that. I'm sorry. I have horrible camera skills. Ah! Okay, okay. Okay. So I have this rose I drew in my art class. It sucks. I'm sorry. Um, yoink! Then I have actually one of my best pieces, which is this bird. I don't know if you can see that, but it's it, it's a bird. Then I have this other bird. I don't know if you can see it. And it's also one of my best pieces. Thank you, Mrs. Lamelli, even though you're kind of a bitch. Um, okay. Let me move my bracelets and stuff. So we have me. And my mom on New Year's. And that was one of the best moments of my life because I was with family and we had a good night and we played with a bunch of <laughs> caves and stuff. And I hung out with Val, my one of my good friends, I think. Are we friends? I don't know. But love you, Val. <laughs> Just letting you know I love you. Um, here are some pictures I took. Well, my dad took these these two, and they're, they're of me, one's of me and my sister. I took a picture of my dad cooking, no, sealing some meat, my kitty, who I love very, very much, my sister, and my kitty again. Um, okay, I know I added a lot of pictures. This is a picture of my friend Ellie, me, which I look disgusting, and my friend Ashley. Who I love very, very much, even though I don't show it. And I want you to know <laughs> that I care about you guys a lot, even though I don't show my appreciation as well as I could. This is one of the best pictures I took. My dad framed it for me. I have the original right next to it. Framed it for me because it was one of the first pictures I took on my film camera. And I really appreciate it. Um, this is when Holly... Kalia and my mom and her younger sister and me all went to the fair together. Yeah, I know she looks angry. She's not really angry. She's just, grrr. No, but <laughs> that was also a really good day because I miss, I miss, I miss it. Um, this picture's of me and my mom when I was a young little girl, older than the pictures I show you. This was a couple fairs ago. And I have it now, and it's on my wall, and I miss you guys so much. And this is when I remember my dad having long curly hair with my mom, and we were a family. Um, these are some of the pictures I took with my film camera again. My Some of my favorites are this one, this one, that scenic view of the trail, and that one. And here's some other ones. That. I don't think messed up, but my dad did. This one's my favorite because of the coloring. These flowers are great, and I love, actually, I love all of them. My favorite one is the smiley face. I don't even know how I got it to get the color scheme like that. And then here's my floral section. And I love this section because I found these in my local neighborhood. Local neighborhood. Ha! Um, I was watching the Bee Movie for the first time with my friend, and literally... <laughs> The first thing I see is like, look, it's the pollen jocks. And of course, being me, the first thing I think of is, jock off to your pollen. So of course, I couldn't help myself, and I drew, drew a picture, 
and I've hung it on my wall. Um, I have a new friend, and her name's Jax. His, sorry, his name's Jax, and he's great. He is my friendo. Um, I added it to my painting collection, and I painted this. And my dad thinks it looks like Michelle Obama. I'm sad. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but this is also Little Saya with my dad. And I remember that purple dress. I used to spin in it, and I used to be a pretty, pretty princess. Ah. Up here are some of the pictures I drew lately when I was, like, on this Alice in Wonderland scheme. Yeah, I have issues. Um, and for anyone who ever spends the night at my house, this is my doodle wall. And every time they come over, I allow my friends to take this giant thing of markers here and doodle on my wall. And they can draw anything they want. So every time I look at it, I can be like, my friend Jasmine was over. I can remember the good memories we had of that night she came over. And I think it's great because I can remember all the good things and not be sad. Um... Okay, let's see. I went to the movies and saw It and Happy Death Day with my best friend Hallie, who is great in her everything. And more, <laughs> when I walked into Happy Death Day, at the very end, I'm not going to spoil anything if you haven't seen it, but I started laughing because she's like, eat the cupcake, bitch! <laughs> and she kicked her out a window. And it was hilarious, even though... I don't know why I left at horror, but I do. Um, yeah. Anyways, um, I don't really know what to talk about again. It's just another random vlog. And again, I'm really sorry at the, from the beginning of the video, the message. I'm really sorry. I want to make it up, and I want to be friends, and I want to talk again, and I don't want to be awkward, but I don't know what to do. Anyways, um... See you in the next video. Like, subscribe, and comment. If you want anything else, you really don't have to do all those. I just do it because every other YouTuber does it. Can you even consider me a YouTuber? I don't know. I don't really care. As long as I get to talk to my friends when I can't see them. So they can see this. I just... The main message is that I want everyone to know I appreciate them. Even though I may not have the time to be able to talk to you over the phone... Like, Mom, I'm sorry I don't call you as often as I, I should. It's either... I can't lie. It's either because I don't remember, or I'm just like, there's other things to do. When really, I should put you first. You're my mother, you gave birth to me, and I love you, and I should appreciate you. Which I do. I love you deeply and greatly, and I want you to know that. And I love you, Dan. You're my stepdad, and I'm sorry for the things that happened in the past. I want to have a new future... And we've been working on it, and that's great. Hallie, I want to know, let you know that just just because I'm a dick to you and we don't like, I don't like cuddling, doesn't mean I don't want to cuddle <laughs> every now and then. And I want you to know that you're a great friend. And to anyone else out there who's my friend, or even a rel relative, anybody close to me, or even acquaintance, even if I don't know you. <laughs> I want you to know that I appreciate you and everything that you do, and I want you to know that you're important in this world, and that even though if you are sad, I want you to know that there's someone out there who cares, and I'm, I'm dead serious. You matter. You're something. And uh, anyways, talk to you later. Bye.